Damn, man. Today is a sad day for Mr. Vasquez, man. I get all these gangster texts from Mr. Meek Mills, right? Yeah, that's, yeah the same nigga I said with me when he was a young boy. And he, and he had nothing, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, he said, well, I'm calling his phone. Texting his phone like, I own, like he owe me. Nigga, you don't owe me, but a man is a man. You mean you said... Oh, let me, oh, let me read the text first. Yo, you know, this, I'm still here young. One hand, watch the other. Go ahead, throw that joint up for me. You know, talking about this little CD cover. I mean, I got you. I, you know, I don't want nothing from you. Just throw my shit up when it come out. Automatically, you know what I'm saying? That's what I take that as. I mean, now he talking about this gangster shit. He said, I said something on my live that hurt his feelings. You talking shit on live. Nigga, I'm talking shit on live because you did some coward shit. I mean, every time your feelings get hurt, you try to run. Like, uh, like nigga, be a man. You the same nigga that was mad when Drake ain't put your shit out. Ain't that what the argument was about? I was in penitentiary, yeah. so I don't know. You know what I mean? For selling drugs, the shit that you lie about doing. <laughs> um, ain't that what that argument was about? Yeah, that was a, that's what it all stemmed over. So now, he asked me to put his shit up. Don't put my shit up. And then talking fly shit. Same nigga said fuck Air Ab, knowing he wouldn't have said fuck Air Ab if you ain't have a thousand niggas around him in a bulletproof car. I mean, cowards run the world, though, so... I mean, it's not, it's not nothing new. It's not nothing that's surprising. One thing surprising that he said it to me, did it to me. And he, he, he said, uh, you act like he, uh, he owe you some shit. Yeah. Don't I mean, he owe you? He owe you for the... T Tony, how you get Tony's story? Well, Tony's story... How you get Tony's story? I don't know. I, it's just, uh, Tony's story sounds a lot like Jamal's story. <laughs> he, he barely changed the name of the motherfucker, John. You know what I'm saying? But, hey, I can just talk shit on the computer. You know? he go, I ain't scared. The fuck told you to be scared? I ain't seen you be scared of me. But that's the first thing he said, though. I ain't supposed to be scared. You know, it's a fucking coward. You know what I mean? But anyway, try to stay positive, man. I mean, keep doing what I do, man. You know what I mean?